Cole with Connor Ben. Welcome to America and your American debut this Saturday night. How you feeling? Yeah, good, bro. Just excited to get back out there and do my thing, man. That's what's up. That's what's up. What do you know about your opponent? It's not that much. He's Mexican. He's tough. He's, tough. he's strong, durable, got heart. Everything else, I'm not quite sure. You know, I just focus on, on doing what I got to do, but the DNA is strong, man. When you're a Mexican, you know what they bring. Looking for an explosive knockout, that's for sure. For your American I'm going to try. I'm going to try, that's for sure. That's what's up, that's up. Now, are you planning to stay at 147 or are you going to move up to 154? Listen, wherever the world title opportunities are, I believe I carry my power up to 154 and 160. So, whatever opportunities present themselves, I'll be ready to go, no problem. Now, there's rumors that after this fight, you're going to fight um, Chris Eubanks Jr. No problem. December. I can't look past this fight. We know what the Mexican bring. You know, it's always like that's Mexico, Britain rivalry, you know, so I've got to do what I've got to do and I'm a handle business Saturday and then the discussions can happen. Now we hope to see you more in America like other fighters from Great Britain like Ricky yeah. Hatton, Amir Khan, yeah. you know, are you planning to make more appearances in America to fight American fighters? Yeah, listen, it will be a blessing. All the world titles are over here. You know, you've got the greatest fighters over here. You know, currently in this era, in this generation, all the world titles in the world weight division are over here. So I've got to come over here and, you know, mark my stamp. Now, one fight that a lot of people would like to see you fight. Yeah. Is a fighter named Jerome Boots Ennis. No what problem, fight? no problem. I love that fight. He's been talking that he wants you. He's no, saying but his, that, trainer you know. said, his trainer said no. You know, so let, we can make the fight. I get asked a lot about the fight, but he never gets asked. Okay. You know, so let's we can make that fight. No problem. I said that I fancy that fight. We can do that. No problem. Not okay. at all. One more question. What do you think about the Canelo Alvarez versus Jamel Charlo fight? It's a hard one. Charlo's been out of the ring for ages. It's the smaller Charlo, I believe. Smaller Charlo. So he's, he's, I'm a fan of both. I'm a fan of both the brothers. I've spoken to the brothers. Canelo's Canelo and Canelo's Canelo. You know, so for me, it's like it's hard because every dog has his day. This, this day could be that day. You know, I like Charlo's the way they fight, their aggression, you know, their spite. You know, they don't play around. What's it, Lions only? Lions only. Lions only. So, your pick? Huh? Charlo, is your pick? Go either way, boss. 65, 45. All right. I say I'm splitting it up. Well, thank you very much. Good luck on your fight tomorrow night. Hope you have a spectacular night. Thank you, brother. I appreciate that.